All right, well, let's try uh, this guy next. I want to see what he does. See how this goes for me. Whoa, what the heck? Oh, I just rose from the ground? Okay, I just run normally. What are my buttons? I got slashes. I got acid spit. I got no money. I got an AOE slam. Okay. And I think that one arcs it towards other enemies. That seems pretty cool. Yeah, I can just chop people up with my claws. This is pretty cool. Although I'm already getting beat up. So that's not good. Ah, ranged enemies. <laughs> My weakness, I guess. Alright, I got shaped glass. Oh, yeah, that's the one that gives me double damage, but I have half my health. That doesn't sound good for me. Like, it, it sounds awesome that I get more damage, but... <laughs> when I'm already struggling against ranged enemies. I honestly don't know how good it is. Seems like this run would be great if I was doing somebody with, like, long range, high damage. <laughs> so, I don't know if it's great for me to pick the melee character. What the heck is that? This list fires, but it costs me money? Oh, but then I just have a Gatling gun. <laughs> yeah, I'm a T-Rex with a shoulder-mounted minigun. Oh, wait, to play slot machine effects. Uh, this is the thing that tries to, like, grab you and pull you close, isn't it? Whoa! Uh, <laughs> I killed it, but it killed me! <laughs> uh, okay, I think that that uh, shard of glass does not help me if I'm a melee character. Can you actually charge a special skill, corrupts all fuel cells? Oh. So I get another R? That's pretty awesome. Yeah. Hey, I got another cell. That means I get a third church. That sounds awesome. Especially with how my art arcs to other things. Hey. Go to the blue portal. Yeah, let's go there. I don't know if going there is a good thing, because that's usually where you can buy stuff that I end up getting and then it ends up hurting me more than helping me. Yeah, like there's all this stuff, but I don't know what any of this stuff is. There's a beetle, there's a hammer and chisel. There's some chocolate bars. There's a some sort of face mask or beetle or something. What the heck is that thing? It's a hammer. Forge five items for a hammer. A hammer sounds pretty cool. Can I do that? Oh, I don't have the cost. Well, I guess we buy this stuff and see what happens. Buy a beetle. What does the beetle do? Transcendence. Convert all your health into shield. Increases maximum health. Okay. What does this one do? Doubles your health, but halves your speed. Oh no! What is this one? I'm just buying all these. You just trying to summon nearby enemies? Is that good? What about this? Items and equipment have a small chance of turning into lunar items instead. Oh! I guess I take two of those then? Carry five. <laughs> no! I'm so slow! This might have been a mistake. <laughs> I need, like, way more speed. <laughs> the whole <laughs> It looks like I'm just going in slow motion now. Okay, well, I'm, like, a super tanky thing now. I just can't move. I became a turtle. I went from a, a T-Rex to a turtle. <laughs> the ultimate creature. Oh, hey, look, there is a lunar item here. I got... Heresy, replace your utility skill with Shadow Fate. Oh yeah, this one. Where I become invulnerable, but now I really have no mobility. Maybe I should just start this up now since I'm already here. I, I at least get to do this much. <laughs> Alright, bring it on. Pot thing. <laughs> I'm moving as though I'm in quicksand, but it's okay. Doing. I guess it doesn't matter. I can't move. It's dead. I killed the boss. 
I'm still moving at a snail's pace. But <laughs> at least the monster's dead. Give me another pauldron. I can move even slower. <laughs> oh, this is gonna suck to try to do anything on. <laughs> It would probably help if I knew anything about this game, like what any item did. Okay, I can go now. <laughs> Maybe. At some point I can. Man, that's my sprinting speed. <laughs> I think I'm in hell now. Or doom. One of the two. Come here, dragon thing, whatever the heck you are. I'll fight you. <laughs> Mostly because I don't really have a choice. Wow, I am super tanky. Man, do I move slow. Yeah, <laughs> turret, I need you to protect me. You know what, it'd be better if you just carry me. Right, let's try this. It took me five minutes just to walk over here. How slow I am with all of this. I do so much damage and I just don't die, but... Man, am I slow. Nope. Oh, we got something. Mark for death. Enemies with four or more debuffs are marked for dead, taking bonus damage. Oh, I see another potential lunar thing. What is this one? Oh no, I have to take it. I have to. <laughs> yes, my speed might be slowed again, but it doesn't matter what I'm moving at the... I'm literally moving at like a snail's pace. But now I have so much HP. Okay, I see where the teleporter is. I gotta get all the way over there, moving at this pace. Okay, I finally made it over to the teleporter. <laughs> I'm 60 minutes in. <laughs> Not even to the last stage yet. Alright, hang on. Oh, slightly faster, yes. I also think it's faster for me just to auto-attack than it is for me to walk. Because I'm so slow. What the heck? Oh. Also, I found that practically nothing can kill me. At least that I've fought so far. Is it just, are they just pushing me away? Come back here. I'll fight you. Eventually. <laughs> no, they just keep pushing me back. Yeah. There we go. I actually started hitting him. You guys killed me. Dang! <laughs> yeah. Wait, killed by the planet? The planet killed me? <laughs> Dead from blunt trauma to the face. Okay, well that was kind of funny. Because I became practically an immortal turtle. Alright, so I didn't even beat the normal difficulty, but those were some fun runs. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this kind of video, and tell me if you'd like to see more Risk of Rain. I do plan on uh, showing it more on the channel, probably in like live streams mostly, and then maybe doing some videos like this every once in a while. I think that could be a lot of fun. And uh, we'll probably be able to move up to like the monsoon difficulty once I actually figure out what the heck I'm doing in this game. <laughs> Uh, thanks everybody for watching this. I really do appreciate it. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Uh, special thanks to the supporters of this channel. These are my members over here on YouTube, my patrons over on Patreon. They get early access to videos like this. Uh, if you'd like to be a part of that, you can. There are links down in the description. Thanks everybody who does that, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!